I'm Ron Wolfley of Arizona Sports 98.7 FM and ArizonaSports.com with your Big Red Wolf Report. Here on the BRWR, or Burra, as we like to say, we examine the game that will be by pulling it through the prism of the game that was. Last week, the Cardinals defeated the Philadelphia Eagles 24-20 in a thriller on the tumultuous waves of the Red Sea. Now the cards are getting ready for an NFC showdown in Dallas against the Cowboys. The big red point number one, run the ball. The Cardinals did not do a good enough job running the football last week against the Eagles. Philly's defensive front was average at best in regard to stuffing the run, but the cards totaled only 71 yards on 23 carries. This was not good enough, and the Cards' offensive line is going to have to pick it up this week against Jarrah's boys if they wish to win this game. Dallas flies to the ball and pursues like a college football team, but they aren't great at getting off blocks when you run right at them. They're number 29 in average rushing yards allowed, giving up a whopping 4.78 yards per carry. The Cards need to give the Cowboys a dose of their own sarsaparilla and pound the football in an attempt to wear their defense down instead of the other way around. Now a disclaimer, go ahead and talk amongst yourself. It is the belief of the Big Red Wolf Report that Romo will play on Sunday. Jerry Jones has let it be known that Romo is healthy and his back contusion is more of a pain tolerance issue than anything else. Romo is tough like a bull rider in a rodeo and better football through chemistry is a definite possibility. We believe Romo will play bringing us to big red point number two. Blitz Tony Romo. The Cardinals mixed it up against Nick Foles and the Eagles. Although complex blitz packages are part of the identity of a Todd Bowles defense, the Cards started the game against the Eagles very conservatively and didn't go after Foles until late in the first half. Then they started upping the ante in the second half, backed off again, and then ramped it up to finish the game. Tony Romo could not handle the blitz last week against the Washington Redskins. Consistently, Romo was sacked and pummeled to the ground on six-man blitzes and cover zero blitzes, bringing everybody. These kind of blitzes are Todd Bowles' hallmarks. The Cowboys will change almost nothing of their offense other than preparing for the Bowles constrictor blitzes. And I don't think Todd Bowles will let them down. Big red point number three. Make those Cowboys tackle. The Cowboys may know how to ride bulls and break them some Broncos, but they struggle to tackle. They give up a lot of yards per play because they miss more than their share of tackles. The Cowboys are number 29 in yards per play, number 29 in rushing yards per play, and number 24 in passing yards per play. They struggle to tackle individually, which is one of the reasons why coach Rod Marinelli demands his players run to the ball and pursue on every play. Arizona did not do a very good job of getting their playmakers in space against the Eagles. Andre Ellington was contained. And other than Larry Fitzgerald's electrifying 80-yard touchdown on a slant, they had to make big plays down the field to move the ball with any consistency. There's nothing wrong with big plays, but Dallas does not give up a lot of big plays. This is why a controlled passing attack and wide receiver screens and Andre Ellington runs will be a big part of what the Cardinals do on Sunday. Make them Cowboys tackle in space. That's going to do it for this week's version of the Big Red Wolf Report. I don't reckon I might see you back here next week on Arizona Sports 98.7 FM and ArizonaSports.com.